Forfeit the game before somebody else takes you out of the frame And put your name to shame, cover up your face You can't run the race, the pace is too fast, it just won't last going on youtube up to party four here coming at you with a quick mail day um feeling kind of under the weather today uh if you can tell my voice is kind of stuffed up and uh i think i'm coming down with a cold or something but anyway i'm going to show you guys a couple cards that i got in the mail this past uh, couple days to my patch set um i picked up this andre brown one color jersey i'm sorry patch um, and that's numbered uh, 21 out of 50. This one was actually kind of uh, pretty hard for me to find. Um, so I had to take the first one that I got so I don't miss out on it. And I'm sitting here with one card left in my set that I don't have. But um, I just purchased the Darius Hayward Bay on eBay. And that completes my set. Um, it was only a buck. So that's sweet. I, I missed out on, on uh, a Darius Hayward Bay probably about... When I first started this set about three months ago, four months ago, and I've been kicking myself over for it, but it saved me like six bucks because I think that one went for like six fifty. That was before he turned out to be a huge bust. But I also picked up this Chris Beanie Wells out of Leaf Rookies and Stars. Sorry, Don Russ Rookies and Stars. It's a three colored patch. Pretty nice. Um, and that is numbered uh, 34 out of 50. And uh, I purchased a couple, couple other Beanie Wells over the weekend and a Brian Rubisky. I'm waiting to get some stuff in the mail, too. So if you guys have any Wells or Rubisky, hit me up. I um, also wanted to talk about a little bit um, on the Cowboy game yesterday. Um, as you can see here on CBSSports.com, which is where I look at most of my stuff. Stars shine bright. There's Tony Romo right there. Um, me being a lifelong Cowboy fan, um, it's a long time coming for them, and I'm super stoked that they're in the playoffs. And um, I think they have a really good shot of making a dent in, uh, in, the, in the Viking season next week too. Um, I know the Vikings are very are, are like a streaky team, and if uh, Demarcus Ware and Jay Ratliff and Anthony Spencer can get at Brett Favre, I think they can make some things happen on defense. So. Um, but it will be a tough game, but uh, I'm super stoked about that. But um, it, it'll be uh, interesting to see what happens next week. Um, but anyway, I'm, um, I just wanted to let everybody know that uh, I have been a lifelong Cowboy fan. It's not, a, it's not one of those fair weather fan deals. But anyway, hope everybody's having a good Sunday morning. Uh, I'm going to get ready and... Uh, get the day started, but I'll talk with all you all guys later, and uh, peace.